you, Ms. Napolitano. The gentlelady from California is recognized for two minutes. I thank the gentleman, and I would like to say I agree with my colleague, is if not now, when? We've been asking that for many, many generations. Uh, the mass shootings, American families are demanding Congress to act. Uh, they want action, but Congress has not heard any bills. They refuse to hear them. There is nothing being given an opportunity to have the light of day or to have some transparency to it. The last meaningful gun violence prevention bill was in 1994, and that was the Brady Hand Gun Violence Prevention Act. Now, shootings, as was pointed out, are now an everyday occurrence, and it's commonplace, so people are becoming numb, except for those that are immediately affected and are asking us to move and pass legislation Give it the light of date, discuss it, bring it up, start some methodology to be able to understand what this House is looking at doing for our American people, for our children, for our families. Now, collective action, we need it. Transparent discussion is necessary and much needed. But enough of skirting this issue, yes. What's more important, gas and oil or the lives of human beings? Keep guns away from people that should not have them and or would use them to harm others. Um, H.R. 1217 mandates universal background checks for all purchases. It's a step in the right direction and would move our country forward in beginning the process of addressing this epidemic that we're facing. We need real, constructive legislation. We need uh, to prevent and lessen violence. We must keep guns out of the hands of people that should not have access to them, such as the dangerously mentally ill. Now, domestic abusers and uh, people with violent histories also should not have access to them, and they currently do. Now, without stigmatizing those with mental illness, because then you have a problem on your hands. We need to inform, educate, and help young people, families, educators, those who are exhibiting emotional uh, disturbance uh, in some kind of exhi exhibition, is helping them learn how to access information and assistance. And with that, I yield back to balance of my time. Thank General you. From Alabama.